Right, here today we have an absolutely stunning looking and superb condition Kawasaki Ninja 650. Uh, this is a 2019 example with only 5,682 miles on the clock. Uh, I believe it's a two owner from new bike. We do have service history and we have the handbook and service book and it would come with a fresh MOT. Uh, so the bike is in absolutely lovely condition and say so you've got it in that striking uh, graphics well obviously the orange and the black racing graphics um, obviously these use uh, Kawasaki's unbustable double overhead cam liquid cooled uh, parallel twin motor which has been used in lots of bikes over the years for Kawasaki so well proven there and obviously the this is one of the later models so it has got the latest sort of ZX10 graphics if you like uh, ZX10 graphics and obviously styling with the new front end uh, so yeah very very looking nice looking bike uh, again ABS twin discs, wavy discs on there, um, built-in indicators. Yeah, lovely looking bike all round. And so I'll sort of zoom in on some of the bits and bobs of the bike so you can see the general condition of the bike. So I say, well, very nice clean on the wheels and the rims and everything. No mocks on the paintwork that I can see. Um, so being very, very well looked after bike. Original exhaust system on there. Obviously, the only thing you sometimes get is obviously the little scuffs on the hill plate, which is what it's designed to do. Um, stops your heels rubbing on the um, the frame and the rest of the bike. Still looking banana shaped swinging arm, just adds to the style of the bike. And then obviously it has got a nice little tail tidy on the back as well, so it tidies up the back end. And again, going around the rear of the wheel, everything really nice and clean. No scuffs or marks on the rims or anything. Like brand new tire on the back, so we may have already parts started to service the bike because obviously they go through the workshop pretty much regardless of cost. So, tires, chains, sprockets, pads, discs, everything is checked. Obviously, we then look in the service book to see whether it's due an annual or which is done if needed. Got uh, a nice little genuine Kawasaki tank pad on there as well, and again, quite a comprehensive instrument cluster on these, which I'll go through you with when I start the bike. And it's a nice little safety feature on these bikes. Obviously, you've got the ABS, which is just that added little safety net safety feature. And I say, very comprehensive instruments on these. So, obviously, you've got a digital speedo, conventional rev counter, but then you've got digital gear indicator, uh, range, uh, digital temperature gauge, digital fuel gauge, and say a nice big digital gear indicator, which is good. Full details of the bike are on our website, speedthrills.co.uk. And if you'd like any further information, obviously you can call on Exeter 01392 211 246. And hopefully if you found this video useful, you could like to give us a like and hopefully maybe subscribe. Thanks again for watching.